multiple power outages affecting traffic to even shutting down LSU's campus. Tonight, the East Baton Rouge Metro Council got the chance to question Entergy about what was happening. Absolutely. NBC Local 33's Jacqueline Kissick is in studio with details on tonight's meeting. Jacqueline. Well, Renee and Jacob, Entergy blamed the weather for the power going out. However, people were buying that. With the AC turning off and businesses having to close, many took to the podium wanting answers. Here we are yet again, and the vendor is not doing what the vendor is supposed to do. EBR I Metro Councilwoman Jennifer Rocca grilling Entergy over the amount of calls the council has received and complaints. And making sure vendors are doing what they're contracted to do and paid for to do should not be our major concern. More than 4,000 people were affected by the multiple power outages all throughout the week. LSU and McKinley High School canceling classes along with other businesses. Entergy took to the podium wanting to ensure the council fixing the problem is a priority. And we absolutely take seriously the responsibility to provide it in a reliable, safe and affordable way. Why all of these outages? Councilwoman Carolyn Cole introduced an item to bring in members of Entergy Louisiana to explain how Energy's transmission source was lost and how this problem has been escalating over the last several weeks. Same thing did not happen again, so perhaps there was another issue and that's you know the specifics of that I can't speak to up here. You all don't give us any breaks on our bills, so why should we look for any breaks for energy because of the excessive heat. Entergy is suspending all disconnections until September 9th. Entergy says there are several reasons why the power outages have been happening. We've got obviously storms and the effects of Mother Nature, which has just been unrelenting to us lately. We've got public inflicted damage in the forms of drivers running off the road and hitting our poles. Many people in the audience took to the podium to express their concerns, ranging from more expensive bills. Went from $400 to $800. Another that went from $800 to $1,000. To the amount of power outages affecting business. 12 in, in the last three or four months, I think it's just too much. And, and this is not when we had the bad weather. And I pay my energy bill every month and we have no resolve and we can't can, can continue business without power. Tonight, the Metro Council demanded Entergy to provide a report on the process they have made in fixing the issues. They hope to have that report within the next 10 days. Now reporting in studio, I'm Jacqueline Kissick, NBC Local 33 News.